So yeah, we've got fuel cell, but it is a different formulation to what they use in their premium uh, racing shoe. So this one is a Piba blend. So 20% Piba and the rest is the EVA type foam. Now, so we've got 20% excitement in this foam and the 80% boring. That's how I explain it, but we've got two layers of that. So we've got the top layer and then under that we've got their carbon plate. Now this carbon plate, uh, it's quite different to other ones that you see in the market. It's got ripples in it, so it's not a flat carbon plate or a convex carbon plate. Yeah, it's got these ripples in it and actually makes this carbon plate quite stiff. So yeah, very rigid shoe. And then under that we've got a huge, again another really big layer of this fuel cell foam. Now geometry wise, the Supercomp trainer is famous for their big rocker. I know the, the V1 and the V2 had these really early stage uh, rockers. That were, yeah, that were quite aggressive. It's been tweaked on this shoe, and it certainly aligns now with the marathon racing shoe, so the SC Elite. So it doesn't feel as early as it used to be, so I think it's come forward, and it's not as noticeable as it used to be in the previous versions. Now, with our Super Blast, they have got their premium race day foam in this. 